let's chill together, let's watch the latest One Piece episode. A gentle reminder, I watch this as a manga reader, so I know all the events, but things are getting more and more exciting in Wana, and I can't wait to see how all of this looks in animation, so let's go! The straw has stepped in and a prora's deadly bottle at the execution ground. Yeah, because uh, the previous episode ended on Zora and Sanji stepping in uh, to defend Toko from Orochi's how they are called pitiful bullets or something like that. The title of the previous episode was very interesting. Oh. <laughs> if if this is not one of the most badass moments in Wana, well, they're showing it uh, through the eyes of one of the citizens. Yes! Oh. <laughs> now, in their whole awesomeness, not in the shadow, we can see them clearly. And this is just the best scene ever. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, like, if they didn't go, Toka would have died. They did the right thing. Yeah, we have to um, be on low here, but we can't just uh, let her die, right? <laughs> oh, it's... Damn, she's so tiny. Zora is just holding her... Like, with one hand. You can see that Orochi is going overboard here. And everybody who is not blind can see that. He really... I don't know, he's stepping on his own foot. Do, is there an expression like that? Just how terrible he is. It's been shot, bits transmitted to the whole country, just like digging it in. Like, how actually he's the worst. They are the. Oh! <laughs> Brown Gora! Oh! That's a new one! And most Jura! Yes, yes! remember these <gasps> the <laughs> new insults it's crazy how here in the anime uh, they're showing them bickering and in the background just Yasui's dead body that's kind of uh, jarring Sang it's like his name, Sangora the Silva Cook. It's like his whole name. <laughs> How can he look at this poster with a serious face? Yeah, the dust still cannot settle. Ew. It's like he wasn't even going to attack Sanji and then only when Sanji spoke up he'd be like, okay, then let's fight. How to explain this? Mm. 
Um, yeah. I guess Saraj is used to everyone being nice to him because he's in the position of power. So he's like, how can he be rude to me? Ooh, nice. For what? To help the rebellion. how uh, Zora has some memories already accumulated with Yasu. Of course he's mad and he wants to avenge Yasu, but at the same time you have to understand that he died for something to help the rebellion, so it's kind of, kind of a tough choice. He blocked. He blocked. <laughs> Repelled. Okay. Yes. Yeah, he was getting to show of himself, did he? At the same time when he's so fearful for his life. He was so mad at Yasu that he didn't care. And came here with not much security. That, that's interesting, actually. Alazarus. <laughs> he looked like he was trying to eat Sanji. Uh, he's so big. <gasps> it's really putting it into perspective how big he is. I. Oh yeah, I'm curious to see like, um, Kiyoshira and Zora in one shot, uh, because Kiyoshira looked so much bigger in manga. I'm interested to see like how, how will it be portrayed here. Yeah, that has to be a right time for the scavards to show themselves to people, to show that they are here, to start the rebellion and all of that. But the pirates are a different story. I think that's fair. <laughs> I don't know, Orochi's character, it's very interesting, like, for analysis, I think. Oh. <gasps> that was such a cool shot right here. <laughs> yeah, this Samurai, this captured samurai, they are confused. Like, um, how would they know that uh, these people are their allies or not? <laughs> oh, yeah, so <laughs> we get all oh, the toad's reaction. Oh, I love it. 
love the toad. Yeah, so we get to see straw heads fights in a bit and like um, helping each other. That's so sweet. Yeah, and one of people see him as magic users because they don't know about devil fruits. I just love now. Oh my god! Zora looks so cool with this background. Oh my god, I really did a cool background here. But damn, I really love when Nami is using her attacks. They look so powerful. It's so nice to see. Okay, Zora versus Kiyoshira. Oh my god, no. <laughs> uh, the middle of the episode. That's. That's so exciting to be honest. Um, these chapters, they were so, it's so nice to relieve these events. And the background they did uh, with using Nami's attack, I think that was just on point. And like also showing Zora's inner feelings. Uh, that is a sweet touch. Oh, we get a lot of Zara fights in here, don't we? I mean, in Juana. It's just... Yes! That's, that line, that was so interesting. When I first saw it, he was like, I'm Shogun Slap Dog. And everyone was like, is there anything more to it? It was a very important line, in my opinion. Oh my god, they showed it as a picture! <gasps> That's so beautiful! Whoa! Oh my god! <gasps> and again, this is such a nice like backdrop to Kiyoshira versus Zoro show off. Man, oh my gosh, all these scenes are just perfect. Oh, and Nami is like in the front. I love this. Ah, <laughs> oh, Luffy, do you like the movie you're watching? <laughs> Yes, Light Scroll Snail, he named it. That's interesting. Ah, I like his lion face. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> I can't, I cannot. That is so sweet. Yeah, that's my fr cool friends I have, don't I? <laughs> well, what would you expect, right? Yes. <laughs> it's actually like they're watching a movie. That's crazy. <laughs> Wait, is it this, this, this chapter? Oh my god, I don't remember everything so well, but... I completely forgot that it happened here. Oh my god. Serious criminal. Oh no. <gasps> this is going to be in this episode. Couldn't fulfill, so he could not. Well, already everyone recognized um, Kamazo, and he was punished because he couldn't complete his mission, and that makes him go to prison. Uh, that is so unfair. Like these episodes, they really show how terrible Orochi's reign is. Like even people who do serve him, they still end up in prison if they fail to execute one single mission. Uh, yeah, everybody already guessed who this is. 
And he, look at him, look at his broken face. Yeah, right. He, yeah, why did he surrender himself if he escaped? You always hated that love of yours. I remember that line from the translation I was reading. You hated this love. Why are you laughing now? What is going on? What happened? So we already know that they are connected. That kid knows him. He is even crying. What? We always saw kid as this vicious person. The real pirate who is like... Not kind like Luffy, but seeing him like this, yes, <gasps> he loves his friend. Oh man, I think I think I actually cried when I was reading it at first. It was such a shock. I didn't I didn't suspect a thing. Okay, yeah, Luffy's trying to remember, like, who Killer is, I guess. Yeah, you can see the similarity in the hair. But, yeah, he wear... See, like, he was shown as this vicious person, as violent person. Oh, but he does have his own values and he does love his friends. I think, I think that's what um, makes him more interesting as the character in this arc. Yes, and now Killer was fed this smile fruit and he can't stop laughing. It, and for him it is especially terrible because he hates his laugh. And for Kid it is terrible seeing his friend like this. Man. And he doesn't understand what the heck is going on, what they did to his friend. think that yeah this is this is making Luffy even more mad I know he doesn't particularly like Jaggy but he is mad because he knows the tragedy when he sees one them that's it and he understands how it must feel for kid and 
he sees this terrible situation that his crew was put in and how terrible killer was treated he was fed this smile he was forced to work for Orochi probably he was told like either you do this or all your friends are going to be killed and executed and kid himself probably so he had to do it and kid didn't know i think he didn't know where he crew is what happened and now he's so kill and he probably is thinking uh, were they all also like fed these smiles fruit where they are what the heck how can i help my friend what the heck is going on he is distraught and luffy is seeing this and it is impacting him also i think this chapter um i think what these chapters are the most impactful in one we see yasui's death uh we get to understand like how serious things are and how trash orochi is and then we see this happen to kill and this puts kids character into perspective and this also shows again like the smiles everything it all come comes together and again shows how terrible things in wana are i think these chapters are really extremely important and honestly i do love how they were portrayed i'm surprised i didn't cry on the reveal because i think i did in manga when i was i was so shocked i was so shocked when i learned that Kamazo is killer. I didn't expect this at all. That was such a surprise. Even though uh, I could have guessed, I'm sure there are a lot of people who did guess because, oh yeah, it looks like we are finally getting hit team because it's pretty cold lately in the night here in Saint Petersburg. So, in my radiator, some hot water is being right now i don't know how to say this but i'm sure you can hear the sound so i think i better finish with this video i think i stated all my thoughts so that's it for now thank you for watching if you are watching this on youtube then share your thoughts in the comments down below that's it for now see ya mm -hmm.